Imagine you're in a time where art, culture, and exploration are at their zenith. Welcome to Spain's Golden Age. Our journey begins in the late 15th century, a time when Spain was poised on the threshold of an era of unprecedented opulence and influence. This was Spain's Golden Age, a period stretching into the early 17th century, and it marked a golden epoch of global dominance in exploration and trade. Picture this, Spain, a country on the Iberian Peninsula, suddenly becomes a world superpower. Its ships, commanded by audacious explorers, sail across uncharted oceans, discovering new lands and establishing trade routes that would forever alter the world's economic landscape. The wealth and resources garnered from these voyages would fuel Spain's ascendancy, transforming it into a global powerhouse. But Spain's golden age wasn't just about exploration and trade. It was also an era of extraordinary cultural growth and artistic expression. The country became a vibrant hub of creativity, where arts and literature flourished like never before. From the evocative paintings of El Greco to the compelling narratives of Miguel de Cervantes, Spain's golden age gave birth to some of the world's most revered artistic and literary masterpieces. This was a time when art wasn't just a form of expression, but a reflection of the society's values, beliefs, and aspirations. And let's not forget the cultural ascendancy that marked this era. Spain's golden age saw the country's culture and language spread across the globe, influencing societies far beyond its borders. Spanish became the lingua franca of the time, spoken and understood in far-flung corners of the world, from the Americas to Asia. This was Spain's golden age, a period of unrivaled grandeur and glory. It was an era characterized by the country's global dominance, the flourishing of arts and literature, and a cultural ascendancy that resonates even today. So fasten your seatbelts as we journey back in time to experience Spain's golden age, a period of unrivaled grandeur and glory. Picture this, Spanish ships sailing across unknown seas, discovering new worlds. This was the age of exploration. Now, let's dive deep into the thrilling tale of Spain's global explorations, a saga brimming with courage, curiosity, and the relentless pursuit of the unknown. The age of exploration, spanning the 15th to the 17th centuries, was a time when Spanish explorers set sail to unknown corners of the world, driven by a thirst for discovery and the promise of wealth. Among these daring explorers, two names shine brightly, Christopher Columbus and Ferdinand Magellan. Christopher Columbus, an Italian explorer sponsored by the Spanish monarchs Ferdinand and Isabella, embarked on a voyage in 1492, seeking a westward route to the riches of Asia. Instead, he stumbled upon the Americas, a new world unknown to Europeans. This monumental discovery marked a turning point in human history, opening the floodgates to European exploration and colonization of the Americas. On the other side, we have Ferdinand Magellan, a Portuguese sailor under the Spanish flag, who embarked on an ambitious expedition in 1519. His goal? To circumnavigate the globe. Though Magellan himself didn't survive the entire journey, his crew did, achieving the first ever circumnavigation of the Earth and proving once and for all that our world is indeed round. But the age of exploration was not just about discovery. It was also about expansion, the expansion of trade routes to be precise. With these new paths to the east and west, Spain seized control of lucrative spice trades and discovered vast reserves of gold and silver in the new world. The wealth that flowed into Spain was immense, fueling an era of unprecedented prosperity. Spain's explorations not only changed the world map, but also laid the foundation for an unprecedented era of prosperity. Yes, the age of exploration was a time of great risk, but for Spain it was also a time of great reward, forever etching its name in the annals of history. Art lovers rejoice. The Golden Age was a time when Spanish art truly came into its own, if we're talking about the flourishing of arts, we can't skip over the profound influence this period had on the world of art. It was during this time that Spanish art broke free from the shackles of its medieval past and began to truly shine. The Golden Age was a playground for artists, and it was here that the likes of El Greco and Diego Velázquez created masterpieces that still mesmerize us today. El Greco, a Greek artist who made Spain his home, was a key figure of the Spanish Renaissance. 
His dramatic and expressive works, often characterized by their elongated figures and vibrant use of color, were a stark contrast to the stoic art of the time. Diego Velázquez, on the other hand, was a master of the Spanish Baroque period. His work was a blend of realism and illusion, and his ability to capture the human soul on canvas was unparalleled. His masterpiece, Las Meninas, is still regarded as one of the most important paintings in Western art history. Spanish Renaissance art was a unique blend of religious and humanist themes. Artists began to move away from the rigid and formulaic medieval styles, instead embracing the beauty of the natural world and the human form. It was a time of exploration and discovery not just geographically but artistically as well. On the other hand, Baroque art was all about drama and contrast. Artists of this period weren't afraid to experiment with light and shadow, creating scenes that were both theatrical and emotional. They focused on the details, the textures, and the play of light, producing works that were rich and immersive. From vibrant paintings to intricate sculptures, art from Spain's golden age continues to captivate audiences around the world. The artwork from this period not only showcases the depth of talent and creativity of the artists, but also provides a window into the cultural and historical context of the time. These masterpieces are a testament to the artistic brilliance of the Golden Age, an era that forever changed the landscape of Spanish art. Spain's Golden Age wasn't just about exploration and art, it was also a time of cultural ascendancy. The period between the late 15th and early 17th centuries saw a remarkable flourishing of Spanish culture, marking an era of unprecedented advancements in literature, drama, and music. Let's start with literature. Spanish literature during the Golden Age saw some of its most significant contributions. The star of this era, undoubtedly, was Miguel de Cervantes. His masterpiece, Don Quixote, is considered one of the greatest works of fiction ever penned. Cervantes masterfully weaved a narrative that was both a critique and a tribute to the chivalric romances popular at the time. His work continues to be a cornerstone of Western literature, shaping the way stories are told even today. The Golden Age also saw a dramatic revolution, with Spanish theatre reaching new heights. The leading light here was Lope de Vega. He was a prolific playwright, penning over 1,500 plays, a staggering feat by any standard. His works, known for their quick wit and complex characters, brought a newfound realism to the Spanish stage. He broke away from classical norms, creating a unique style that resonated with the common people, thus popularizing theatre like never before. Now let's not forget music. The Golden Age was also a time of innovation and creativity in Spanish music. Composers like Tomas Luis de Victoria and Francisco Guerrero composed works that combined the complex polyphony of the Renaissance with the emotional depth of the Baroque. Their compositions, filled with ethereal harmonies and intricate melodies, still echo in concert halls across the world. So you see, Spain's golden age wasn't just about the discovery of new lands or the creation of stunning artworks. It was also about the birth of a vibrant, rich culture that would go on to influence the world in countless ways. From the pages of Don Quixote to the stage of Lope de Vega, from the melodies of Victoria to the harmonies of Guerrero, the cultural ascendancy of this period has left an indelible mark on the world. The cultural richness of Spain's golden age continues to influence the world, even centuries after its end. As we conclude our journey, let's reflect on the lasting impact of Spain's golden age. A period of unprecedented exploration and cultural ascendancy, the golden age of Spain has left an indelible mark on the tapestry of human history. Its influence permeates the realms of art, literature and global exploration, shaping not only contemporary Spain, but the world at large. In the realm of art, the Golden Age was a time of profound creativity and innovation. The works of masters such as Velázquez and El Greco still captivate us today, their brushstrokes echoing across centuries. Their artistry continues to inspire modern artists, their themes and techniques forming the bedrock of numerous artistic movements. Venturing into literature, we find the timeless masterpiece Don Quixote by Miguel de Cervantes. Penned during the Golden Age, this epic tale of a deluded knight and his faithful squire has become a cornerstone of Western literature. Today, its influence can be seen in countless works, its themes of honor, chivalry, and madness resonating with readers around the globe.
The spirit of exploration that defined the Golden Age has also left a profound legacy. It expanded our understanding of the world, opening up new territories and cultures to European influence. This era of discovery set the stage for our modern globalized world, its pioneering spirit reflected in every expedition that pushes the boundaries of the known world. Spain itself has been forever marked by this era of glory. The grandeur of its golden age is still palpable in its culture, architecture, and national identity. The Spanish language, spread across the globe during this period, is now the second most spoken language worldwide, a testament to the far-reaching influence of this remarkable era. Though the golden age has long since passed, its legacy lives on, reminding us of a time when Spain was at the peak of its power and glory. The echoes of this bygone era continue to reverberate, shaping our world in ways we may not always realize, but can appreciate when we take a moment to reflect.